For investment purpose, the FCRA is governed by Section 8 of the FCRA Act and Rule 4 of FCRR Rules 2011. The Section 8 says that FCRA funds cannot be used for any speculative investment. Now the word speculative here means that any investment which has a loss of losing its capital is would be known as speculative in nature. Like for example, any mutual funds, any shares that are brought from FC funds will not be eligible to be brought from FCRA funds. Since they are speculative in nature, since they have a risk of losing or reducing their capital. You see, I think uh, what we need to make a distinction is uh, between utilization and investment. Okay. Now, what Rajesh mentioned is about investment. Hmm? But what the question is about, you are talking about utilization, plant and machinery. Of course, plant and machinery is generally not relevant in a development program. But utilization is always possible. Which utilization means once you utilize it is written off. Investment means it continues in the balance sheet of the organization. So what Rajesh mentioned is that speculative investments are not permitted out of foreign contribution. But utilization, valued utilization is possible. For example, you are working in a community in agriculture and the community needs um, uh, a tractor and you buy the tractor and hand it over to the community. So it is a procurement of an asset but it is also for the purposes of the project and it is utilization. So this is always possible, this, this kind of whatever is being utilized for the purposes of the project. So that distinction need to be made. And what about uh, utilization for marketing and things like that, advertising or marketing? So advertising or marketing, I mean there is, see that is another um, area that we are going, going into that will not be considered generally as um, utilization for program purposes. It will be much more in the administration realm okay. and according to the FCRA law, there is a cap on how much of administrative expenses you can have which is now 50%. So up to 50% of the total contribution you can use it for administrative purposes and at least 50% has to be for program implementation. So marketing will not be necessarily a, a program implementation. So it cannot be justified as program implementation.